Hey guys, how you doing? It's Henry at Mowers and Blowers! Welcome to another weekend product review. Yesterday I received the package from my friends over at Top Don. Top Don makes uh, automotive accessories, accessories uh, for wrenchers like us, you know. Um, if you've never heard of Top Done, then you haven't seen my other reviews on the Top Done battery load tester, uh, battery tester, analyzer. It gives you a ton of information on here that you would normally not get from a regular battery load tester. It's very good and not expensive either, you know, really useful to, to have if you're a guy that you know, uses a lot of batteries for whether lawn tractors or automotive or anything like that. You can really analyze the health of a battery. I also have a Top Done Tornado 1200. This is a intelligent, smart battery charger. And I almost feel like it could rejuvenate a dead battery with its built-in desulfator um, feature in it. So this has been very good too. However, when I've used this, if you have a completely dead battery, it won't even read anything. It's got to have a little bit of juice in there. You know what I mean? That's my only gripe about it. But uh, it does seem to bring back batteries. Yeah, I've, it, I've saved two or three batteries using that thing. But anyway, they sent me this uh, yesterday. It is a jumper pack. Wow, that's cool. I mean, come on. You guys know. With my videos, I'm always jumping batteries because I'm testing tractors, you know, to get them to work. And after a bunch of cranks, you know, your battery's gonna go dunsky, right? Well, you know, I always use a good good jumper pack. Comes in this nice uh, nylon case with a Velcro opening. Has two separating dividers in the back, uh, on, in the inside. And here's the jumper pack itself. So this is a top done. Jump Surge JS1200. They like to use the number 1200, don't they? <laughs> uh, so anyway, uh, really easy to use. Um, when I got it last night, I was looking it over and it had three bars out of four. So I recharged it. It's so easy to use. You just press the button here, right? And it shows four bars fully charged. That's all there is to it. You just turn it on, you know? Uh, in the other divider, you have instructions, which you guys know I never read, right? And you really don't need to read these instructions because you, you push a button. That's all there is to it. It's a charging uh, cable, USB-C type, which is the standard moving forward because it's reliable. You can stick it in any way, which way, and it'll charge, you know? Um, anyway, so you would, there's a little opening over here where it has the input to your jumper pack, your jumper cables. And, uh, well, actually, nope, this is for your charging, I guess. <laughs> Never mind that. So, on the other one. <gasps> Excuse me, there's a lot of pollen here on the East Coast. Anyway, so you got three openings. Uh, one opening is for your brick-type charger, right? Or you can probably connect some kind of solar panels to it. On the other side is your USB-C input, right? And then on the very top opening is where you actually have two uh, USB inputs, right? Where you can actually charge your phone or any other items that you wanted to charge because this acts that, uh, as a battery pack too, you know? And then you have this area here where you can plug in your jumper cables, right? And you can't plug it in wrong. It goes in only one way. And so uh, it has a... Um, Circuit protection, uh, you can't get electrocuted from this. Look, even if you test it, it won't do it, right? It has to sense the battery before it releases it. So look, you won't electrocute yourself. You can do this, no big deal. And it's on, you know what I mean? So it has to sense the circuit, you know, which is very intelligent, right? Uh, also, if you put this on reverse, right, by accident, sometimes you can't see the positive and negative on the on the battery. So, you know, it's easy to confuse it. It has that uh, protection, too, where you can't electrocute yourself or damage the battery by putting it on wrong, you know. So it, it the technology these days is, is uh, very advanced, you know. So there's nothing to it. It's a, a great little battery pack, and I've had a few of these from other companies, and... 
you would think that these would not work because it's so small, right? But you can jump a truck battery. You can jump, if you guys have Mercedes, you'll know that it takes a tremendous amount of amps to start a Mercedes engine. I don't, I have no idea why, but the batteries from Mercedes car, $100, $600, but they last like 10 years. So you get what you pay for, right? Um, there's nothing to it, man. You push the button to turn it on. You push it again and you'll have a, sorry, you push it for three seconds and you have a light. You push it again and it has a strobe light. So you can put this on the ground while you're changing a tire or something so that the cars won't hit you from behind. And then if you're really in a jam, you press it again and it has the universal SOS signal, dot, 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 dash, dash, dash. And uh, this basically, <laughs> if you're Tom Hanks on that island, you know, and a plane flies over at night, you'll probably be able to see it. So this could save your life. And you press it again and it stops. Very useful. Uh, didn't take very long to charge it that one bar. But uh, I don't have anything to jump right now. But trust me, these things are very, very strong. I've had a few of them. And uh, I know it's the size of like two iPhones put together, right? But uh, very, very powerful. You just have to make sure it's always charged. So you just throw this in your glove compartment, man. And if you're ever in a pinch or something like that where your car wouldn't start, you've got this handy right in your glove compartment to uh, get going again. Uh, also, if your iPhone or your phones are, are dead and you need some battery power, you can charge it with this thing too. So very handy. I'll leave a link in the description if you guys want one. You should all have one, to be honest with you. If not you, at least your wife and kids, if they're driving around. Um, they leave the lights on. Your kids, you know, they're not really responsible these days. So you, they keep their lights on or they keep the door open and overnight and your battery's dead. You got to go to work the next day or school. Boom! Start it right up. You know what I mean? Uh, thanks a lot for joining me on today's very brief uh, product um, review. There's nothing to it. It's a jump starter. It works. It's a good product. See you guys next time on Mowers and Blowers. See you guys next time on Mowers and Blowers. Hey, if you guys enjoyed the video, remember to give me a like. Also, comment below. Subscribe. Remember, it doesn't cost anything to subscribe. It's free, right? Also, hit that little bell. That way you'll get post notifications whenever there's a new video and you won't miss out on any of them. Remember to follow my Instagram and Facebook, as well as if you'd like to donate a dollar or two, paypal.me slash mowers and blowers. Really appreciate all the support. Also, to keep the videos coming every day, support the channel. Bye.